And welcome back to XCOM Enemy Within and to our, well, A- minus team, I'm going to call these guys, because they are actually really, really good. Most of them are very high skilled. So, although it isn't my A plus team or my A team, A minus, it, it's in the A's, definitely. But yes, we are about to launch to Delhi in order to uh, try and dissuade some aliens from forcing sexy fun times on unwilling human partners. Yes, I'm looking at you, Chrysalids. I know you've got a lot of love to give, but just no one wants it from you. I'm sorry to be the one to break it to you like this, but it's just the truth. Morbid future. Oh, dear God, we're all gonna die. Oh, my Lord. We're doomed. I may as, may as well just initiate the self-destruct on the Sky Ranger. It would be more merciful. Morbid future. Oh. The chrysalids are going to have their way with us. One thing, I think I've mentioned it before, but although the chrysalids in this are significantly more terrifying than they were in the original, there's, there's something about this that the fact that it's always chrysalids that, I don't know, just takes away a little bit of the magic, I suppose. Oh, I know, I know, I can see. There's 18 of them. But it used to be that whatever primary race was initiating the attack would bring along a different type of terror weapon. Chrysalids were one of them. Um, they were like these crazy armor pig things. Um, cyber discs, sectoids, uh, sorry, sectopods. They were all um, terror weapons initially. And it was interesting to not know what you were going to face. Well, until much later in the game when you had the technology to find out. But, uh, yeah, all of a sudden, we lack that. And, I don't know, I think we've lost something as a result of that. Now, Evelyn, I need to know what's down there, so uh, please stealth and give me sight. Oh dear. What did you see? What did you see, Evelyn? Uh, Cerberus sees something. It is a floater. Fantastic. It is another floater as well. Hmm. Well, I can go for either one. But this one is probably going to have a fairly good critical. Uh, yeah, let's open it up in a big way. Take the shot. There we go. That's one down. Now he's going to be a little bit annoyed. Yes, your friend just got killed. I don't really care. Well, I do really. <laughs> that is completely untrue. I do feel a little bit of pity for these things. I mean, you know... They are basically just alien slaves forced to fight for some greater evil power. Slight spoiler there, but uh, I, I assume it's kind of obvious that they're not very smart. Not smart enough to lead an invasion by themselves, anyway. Right. Um, Drag, I think you may actually be capable of seeing him. And No, oh, damn it, you're not. I was hoping that you would be. What about you, Revocane? If you get here, will you be able to spot him and take a shot? Maybe? No? Oh, that sucks. Alright, Samsara, so you'll be able to snipe. So let's get you over here. Oh. We didn't even get the chance to rescue that civilian. Look a little bit of sad. Right, Brandy Bay. You can more or less just... Well, I don't want to get you too close, actually, because he might take a shot at you with a grenade. Let's move you over there. Spread you away from the car a little bit. Now, you could use collateral damage, but I don't think there's much point at this time to do that. You'd go... You'd use up all of your ammo to do it. Okay. Oop. That's not what I meant to press. Let's uh, put everyone who can overwatch into overwatch, except for Evelyn. Well, actually, she can't go into it anyway, because she dashed. Okay. Oh dear. Here come the mechanized cavalry. Bad times ahead. Right, Cerberus, I'm probably going to be relying on your disabling shot here. Oh, really? Don't you think that's a little bit, you know, cheat hacks? Oh, that is a shame that you missed with that. 
Brand Bay, that would have done a lot of damage. Did everyone miss? My god, I just, I don't even know what to say. I'm stunned by how terrible your, your aims are. Yeah, that's pretty much how I feel right now as well. Alright then. Evelyn could take a shot, but I don't really think she should. Alright, Cerberus, who can you see? You can see... He's open, so you could do some damage to him. You could go for a drone, another drone, or that drone. I think... I think it would be better to try and hit him. Possibly with a critical? Okay, no, that's fine. You, you've uh, holo-targeted him, at the very least. Samsara has a 100% shot on him. Let's go for a headshot. 45% chance of critical. Okay, not too bad. Four damage. I'm not going to turn my nose up at that. Now, you've got 100% as well. Up to six damage. Only three. That's not so good. Brandy Bear. You've got a 79% chance. That's actually fairly good for you. Go for it. And you actually hit. Well done, Brandy Bear. Even Brandy Bear hit it. That, that's unheard of. Right, okay. At this point, a rocket would kill it. And might also kill its drones. Thing is, try and avoid hitting any civilians. I'm hoping this won't hit any civilians, but I can't be sure of it. Doesn't look like it. It should have given me a uh, friendly fire warning if it was going to. My god. Did I just... Did I just kill a bunch of civilians? Please tell me I didn't. A chrysalid is dead over there. Hmm. I think I may have actually just killed a chrysalid. I may have killed two chrysalids? What? I don't understand. But there are two civilians now dead. Did we just hit them? I was certainly weren't going to. Should have told me if I was. No. Chrysalid deceased. Okay, that's what the extra death was. Okay, that that's fine. Revocane is not the sort of person who'd be able to live with the knowledge of uh, killing. An oh wait, no, it is Revocane. He wouldn't really. Well, he'd care. It just wouldn't care enough. Right, eighty-six percent chance there. I mean, a pizza would cheer him up. Let's 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 be honest about this. There we go. Another drone down. You're out of stealth, but it was worth it. We've just eliminated a very large amount of the enemy forces there. Welcome back. Oh, goodbye. I don't think he wanted to play. Or, or him, actually. Oh, okay. So I feel offended that you don't want to hang around? I, I don't know. But I'm surprised we managed to kill so many chrysalids so quickly. I'm really happy with that, in fact. Right. Evelyn, I need you to get in there and tell me what you see. Nothing can see you at the moment, so you should be fine. And you'll get that civilian out of the way. I hope. Will it work? Yeah, oh yes, it will. Fantastic. I wasn't actually sure that it would. Now, is there heavy cover over there? No. But you can see... Oh, fantastic. You can take the shot. Go for it. 70% chance. And you actually hit it, only for one damage, mind, so it's not great by any stretch of the imagination, but still. Alright, Brandy Bear, you need to reload. Never came. It's a risk to go up there, but... There are civilians that need rescuing. There's also civilians that need rescuing in here. you got up there, it would be useful to you. But I don't think there's a way that you can get up there easily. Okay, I'm going to have you move and open this door. Anything? No, okay, good. Alright, drag. You can't quite reach. Okay. Um, 
Okay, I'm going to have Drag advance slightly. He's not going to reload this turn, but he may reload on the next. Rather came. Just to prove how much of a nice guy you actually really are, you're going to go and rescue this civilian. And possibly die in the process. Oh, goodness gracious me, there's Chrysalid down there then. Okay. I'm not sure how you spotted him, but okay. Did he get out of the way? Oh, stupid civilian! You're joking me. I'm going to have to waste another turn. I don't know why we're even trying to rescue you. Okay. You're not going to engage. You're going to remain in stealth for now. So I'm sorry, you're going to watch for anything going for those civilians, and Drag is going to cover the civilians just over there. Now, I need to be aware of keeping Evelyn away from cover that could collapse. We saw that happen with Lilith, that a, a roof was on fire and her cover broke, which meant that she r came out of stealth. What's going on over there? Is that civilians moving around, perhaps? In the original XCOM, it used to have a different message. It would be alien activity and then civilian activity, or uh, friendly or neutral activity, something like that, that uh, let you know that it wasn't the aliens moving around at the very least. Right, okay. get out of here. Get to the ship and keep your head down. Indeed. Don't ever let me catch you around these parts again. Now, Revocane, I would like you to come up here. That's heavy cover. Oh, there's loads of people up there. Right. Can you see him still? You can. 70% chance, once again. No chance of a headshot, really? Enemy defense. Wow, that's actually not good. Okay, just go for a regular shot then. I'm gonna hit him? No, bad. Bad Cerberus. Right, you're gonna have to reload on the next turn then. Samsara, let's see if we can get in there and try and help the civilians. Slowly, but we'll see. Brandy Bay. Could perhaps get in there and deal with any chrysalids, maybe. I'm not sure, though. Got a 96% chance of hitting him, but I don't think that would help me in the slightest. Uh, if I could get up there, I might be able to... Uh, no, I don't think that would be wise. There's a chrysalid in there, isn't there? What I need is Ravikane and his rockets. I could have it perhaps get all the way over here, into the heavy cover there, rescue that civilian, or this heavy cover there, which will be out of the cyberdisc site, and rescue that civilian. Moving yes, let's do that. Position. Let's hope he wasn't on Overwatch. Oh dear. What? What did I just see? Oh, okay. It was a zombie behind that crate. I thought we caught a chrysalid in the act. I, I was like, how is that even possible? It's meant to be a turn-based game. Oh, I'm glad I was mistaken. Right. All right. Uh, no, Drake, you're going to remain on Overwatch, not reloading for you this time. Some Sarah, I want you to move up with Evelyn. There shouldn't be anything that you need to worry about there. Brandy Bear. Move forward just a little. Okay. Go into Overwatch. Uh, as much as I, I tend to say that I'm going to put the safety of my soldiers ahead of civilians, I mean, my soldiers will put the safety of civilians ahead of their own safety. And I can't disregard their wishes, really. As much as I would like to keep them alive and not the civilians, I've got to at least make an effort to try and save the civilians. Alright. Lalith? Uh, sorry, uh, Evelyn? Let's get you further ahead. Because you can stealth in order to get there. Oh, no, you can't, apparently? What? Why won't you stealth? Oh, it's not full cover. Damn it all. That was stupid of me. Okay, who do you see? You see a zombie. 
Go for a headshot, 100%. Well, you may do some damage. Actually, you almost killed him. Well done. And Cerberus sees him, but is out of ammunition. That's not so good. Let's get Cerberus forward a little bit. In fact, let's see if we can get Cerberus up onto the roof. Actually, we'll move forward to this car and then reload. And then if we get an opportunity, we'll move up. Now, uh, Brandy Bay. Do I dare come through here? Believe there is a chrysalid in there somewhere. Dry can't reach the door to open it for you. Revocane. I could... Go on, Revocane. Be the hero that you know you are. Oh, and you say, say both of them. Well done. Can you see him? Oh, you can see him. Well, that's not good. I don't want to see him. Run away! Forget about being a hero. Just save the civilians. We've saved eight so far. There are only two lost. There are eight left to save. Well, I'm not going to say it's going good, but uh, it's going something. Now, I believe they will. Uh, there might be a chrysalid in there. I don't want to risk it, necessarily. Okay, I'm going to have... Go ahead and reload. You've had half ammo for too long. Randy Bear will give you cover while you're reloading. Oh, dear. Ah, uh, bugger. Uh, we were a little bit too late. Oh, wow. It's an albino chrysalid. Not seen that before. How crazy. Kill it. Hit it and kill it. You did. Brandy Bear. You're amazing. Well done. Indeed. Right, it will be dead on the next turn. Of that I have no doubt. I've got two soldiers there who have very good aims. Who should be able to take care of it. Oh, bugger it. Oh, never mind. Brandy Bear's going to punch you. Oh, actually, you're now in front of a car. Wow. That changes things a little bit. I can't can't quite just... Ah, damn it. Rather keen. There's one more civilian up there. Can you get to them? You can. Please do. You're proving everyone wrong today, Ravikane. You're being very heroic indeed. Now, I want... Can you actually... You can't actually see anyone right now. Fine. We're going to use this turn to get you up on the roof then. Out of the way of that car. By getting away from the car, Brandy Bear is clear to punch the chrysalid through the car. And that will be good. Brandy Bear, punch away. Through the car, preferably. Make it a big explosion. Fantastic. You didn't let me down. Right. Now, you only see one enemy. If I swapped your pistol... Please kill it. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. Somehow, somehow I knew. All right. Well, I accounted for this possibility. All right, Evelyn, I need you back here. You should only see one enemy. Swap to your pistol, because I don't need you to have your... I don't need the damage from your main weapon, and the pistol doesn't need to be reloaded, so I'll preserve the ammo in that by taking this shot. It's only got one pip of health, so it's a guaranteed kill. Well done. Is that a real fallback? Or is that a kind of fall forward, fall back? Because it's important for me to know. Hmm. Is that guy still alive? He is. There was a chrysalid in there. Well done. Hard as nails. Right, you're going to have to uh, remain in overwatch there. Oh, dear me. Oh, dear, dear me. What is he doing? Rever Kane, you're on your own up there. Not a good place to be on your own, really. I would like it if you pulled right 
back. Uh, down to here would be good. Running. That just gets you out of the way of any surprise chrysalid leaping up onto the roof scenarios. Now, who can you see? You can see the chrysalid and you can see the cyber disk. That is not good times. I would like you possibly to move. You can see the chrysalid only. Where's Cerberus? Can Cerberus... Yes, you can see the chrysalid. Okay, go for a headshot on the chrysalid. If you can kill him, that's fantastic, because Evelyn can move in stuff. Oh, bad time to... Cock up your damage. Alright. We're going to retreat. I'm going to pull back for a little ways. I'm going to move Samsara back here so she can still take an opportunity shot if she needs to. And I'm going to have Evelyn move back down here. The, that will actually make her... What did I just do? Did you just... You reloaded. Can I not... Run and gun? Ah, oh, damn it all. That was terrible. I clicked on that and it must be a shortcut to reload if it's already the weapon selected. Ah, oh, that was bad. That was really bad. Please keep it safe, Samsara. Problem is, I'm worried more about the cyber disc than I am about the chrysalid at this point. Okay, the chrysalid's probably gone off to try and get some uh, civilians. Oh, bad luck, Brandy Baby. You've had such good aim up to now. Uncommonly good aim for you. Well, okay. One damage. It's It's something, at least. Right, who else is going to take? Oh, you've got two shots. Well done. Well done, Drag indeed. Yeah, it's going inside, is it? Is it my turn? It does appear to be my turn. All right, Ravikane. This is an opportunity for you to use another rocket. If I can get it to go down there. Is there any way I can convince your rocket to hit him? Looks like there is. Make it so. Shot is blocked. Can I hit it there? Will it hurt him? I just don't know. Don't think it will. Yes, I can. Okay, take the shot. Hoorah, Hoorah indeed. No, don't... My God, he's walking on air. You crazy man. He's even packing up his weapon while standing in the sky. Revocane is magic. Alright, come on then. He's shredded, should take more damage. We should be able to take him out in this turn. Between all of us. Let's see if Samsara can get the kill. No, you can't even see him, really? What kind of wizardry is that? Evelyn will be able to move into a position to take him out. So I'm going to go ahead and have Brandy Bear advance and then take the shot. Brandy Bear does not have enough ammo, does she? No, of course she does not. Well, balls. Get in there, Brandy Bear. Uh, Evelyn. I really do need him taken down if you can. Okay, good. It's a confirmed kill for you. And again... Let's use your pistol in that case. And take the shot. Good work. Alright, Samsara. Can you get up there? How would you go about getting up there if I wanted you to? Is there a pipe around there? No, there is not. Is there any way up onto that roof? There's a ladder, okay. Then it is towards the ladder that I'm going to have to take you. Evelyn can go and get the uh, the 
other person over there. You can go into Overwatch for now. It is clear, however, that you're not in a good position. I need you somewhere else, Cerberus. Let's take you down. And we'll try and get up on that roof with you as well. Swap to your pistol and go into Overwatch. Okay, a couple of people should get a shot now. Ah, oh, really? Negative damage. Come now, Cerberus. I've taught you better than this. It looks like you're on aim, though. Well done. Very well done, Samsara. Negative. Dry. That's okay. We'll get you uh, rearmed soon. But I think the two civilians that were down there are dead. Bloody chrysalids. Oh no, they're there. They're just by there. They're falling back. <laughs> They've got a funny way of doing that. Take the shot, Ravocane. Make it count. <laughs> Fantastic. No need. We already are. And because you've got Bullet Swarm, that isn't even the end of your turn. Right, Cerberus. Let's move forward. Get that civilian out of the way. All right, Branded Bear, you can make your way over here and get these two out of there as well. Though I'm not sure if they would be more afraid of you running towards them than the aliens, actually, given your size. Right, Drag, you can... There's no reason to have you there anymore, so I'm going to move you forward. Actually, you need to reload, so I'm going to move you over here first, and then have you reload, and then, on the next turn, move to the next location I want you to be. Back online. Right, Lelith. Uh, sorry, Evelyn. I keep doing that. She's going to get angry with me. Let's get you down all the way over here. You should be concealed, and you can let me know what's there. And finally, Samsara. I can't see anyone else, but uh, we need to get up here, so yes. just run. Okay. Right. I believe there is only... Only... Oh, no, actually, Ravikin can go into a watch as well. Ah, oh, damn it, we lost another one. Ah. <sighs> Grieves me. Now get down there, Ravikane. If we can kill him before the zombie wakes up, we might not have to kill the zombie. That would be nice. Cerberus, I think it's time for you to pull out your sniper weapon. Drag. Let's pop you by there, and you can go into Overwatch from there from now on. Evelyn. Let's remain stealth, shall we? There's still one civilian here somewhere that I can't account for. This worries me. Where is the last one? Actually, reload your gun. Oh, no, that's not what I want to do. Alright, where's the last civilian, guys? I need to know where the last civilian is. Are they in here somewhere? They must be. It's the only place I can imagine them being. Unless they're out here. But I don't see them. Make yourself known to us! We are here to help you, you fool! Damn it! Is that someone crouching the corner there? No. Okay, I can only assume that there is a civilian out there somewhere, unless it counts that one as still a civilian until it is hatched as a, as a zombie. Okay. In that case, Brandy Bear, we need you to move out. We need sight on this chrysalid so that we can save this civilian. And it doesn't look like we're going to get it. Okay, then reload. Uh, you remain on Overwatch, Ravikane. 
Same for you. I think it's too late. Damn it. Okay, take him out if you can. Nice work, Rubber King. It's a shame we couldn't get him before he uh, messed up that civilian, but not much we can do about that now. Cerberus, you may be able to take it out. Okay, that's not too bad. I can always have Brandy Bear just punch it. That's right. Come towards Brandy Bear. She will give you merciful hugs. Alright. The sort of hugs that will set you free. There we go. Don't worry, it will all be over soon. <laughs> you literally destroyed loads of walls in a row. Excellent civilian saved. I am really impressed. Achievement unlocked as a scalpel. I approve. Well done. Morbid future for the aliens, it would seem. Or, you know, the civilians that got turned into zombies. Them too. Wow, I am actually quite impressed that we managed to do that so well. What did we get? How much panic was reduced? If all our missions go Ooh. as well as this one did, the aliens don't stay. Well, I don't know. There were a couple of civilians that could turn into alien zombies. Did you miss that bit? But Drake got a promotion to a major. Well done, Drake. Suppression. Fire barrage that pins down the target, granting reaction fire against it and imposing a 30 penalty to aim. Okay, well, that's not too bad. And with a scope, you now have over 100 aim. I think you may have had that already, but 101 will is actually pretty good. Well done, Drag. And Samsara got a promotion. What are you going to get? We could have Disabling Shot or Gunslinger. Confers two bonus damage with pistols. Hmm. Actually, we're going to go for Gunslinger. I'm building Samsara a slightly different way than I usually do with snipers, and uh, we're going to see how effective that becomes. Whoa, 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 whoa. How much was Samsara's aim? I think it was like 90-something. Cerberus has been promoted to Colonel. Fantastic. And we have in the zone or double tap. Allows both actions to be used for standard shot, headshot, or disabling shot, provided no moves are made. Or in the zone. Killing a flanked or uncovered target with the sniper rifle does not cost an action. Okay. And your stats are now forever locked at 96, 94, and 10. But, oh. If I give you mimetic skin, I could probably get you into positions where in the zone would become crazy powerful. So, yeah, we're going to go for that. We're going to see how that plays out for you. Well done, team. That was perfectly executed except for you know the civilians that got killed but almost perfectly it was it was really well done panic in india is decreased by two panic has decreased across all of asia as a result of that panic mission that was fantastic that only happens if you do really well the panic decreasing across the Remember, continent we will be watching oh i am so pleased with that that's uh before i wrap up this episode another one that ended in only one episode and a panic one at that my goodness but look at that look at asia right now that is fantastic my goodness okay well this episode has actually played out quite well i think uh, we can all agree and there's not even anyone in the med base, so they're all going to be at the bar, probably, or at least two of them, maybe some of them working out, maybe some of them having a chat. Let's go see who's having a chat. I don't actually recognize who's having a chat. Oh, actually, that's Skaven. But that is it from me and from XCOM for this episode. I do hope you've enjoyed. I do hope you'll be joining us for the next. But until then, and as always, do take care.